So it looks like Miss Wendy is not getting better and her fans are trying to cancel her network because they're replacing her show. I don't know about this move y'all, it's not looking good at all. Hi baddies. So as you guys probably know, Wendy Williams has not had a good year at all. And I don't think I will be being dramatic when I say that 2021 hasn't exactly been her best year. She has been through a lot. And just when fans thought that things were finally going to get better for her, well, things got worse because it looks like her talk show may be getting replaced. So what exactly happened and how on earth did Wendy go from hosting one of the most watched talk shows to getting kicked out by the network? Well, it all started on the 9th of September 2021 when Wendy's team made this post on her Instagram page that said that she was dealing with some health issues and would be unable to complete her promotional activities for the 13th season of The Wendy Show. So the new season was scheduled to premiere on the 20th of September 2021. But as you guys probably know, the premiere date was moved back to October 4th before finally premiering on October 18th, 2021. Despite her promise to appear on the talk show when it premiered, Wendy was absent due to health reasons. Now for those of you who don't know, Wendy has been struggling with a couple of physical and mental health conditions that have left a toll on her body. A couple of years ago, she was diagnosed with grave disease, which is a medical condition that can have some pretty serious effects on the body, especially in a woman of Wendy's age. In October 2021, Wendy's team posted this update on her Instagram page and explained that she was experiencing some complications with her Graves disease and her thyroid condition and that she would return to the show as soon as she was cleared by her doctors. Apart from her struggles with Graves disease, Wendy also got COVID this year and even though she managed to beat it, it probably wasn't easy on her body. Now, like all this wasn't enough on her body to bear. It was also reported that she was hospitalized for psychiatric issues, but the exact details of that weren't made clear. Then in September 2021, photos of Wendy vaping and being pushed on a wheelchair went viral on social media, and this made some fans extremely worried about her because she looked so sick and everyone was wondering what on earth was going on with Wendy. It kind of feels to me like she has been struggling for the most part of the year, you know, from dealing with her health issues to her mental health, dealing with fans who were disappointed that she wasn't able to make an appearance on her show since it premiered in October. It has been a lot for Wendy to process. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like things are going to get any better for Wendy anytime soon because the word on the street is that the network is going to replace her show if she doesn't return soon. Now, before I go into details, I want to take a minute to talk about how unfair this would be if it happens. I mean, the network is making it seem like she is choosing not to come back to the show when we all know that isn't true. Until she is medically cleared and given the green light by her doctors, there is pretty much nothing that she can do. I don't think it's fair that the network is giving her one more thing to worry about rather than giving her the time and the peace of mind that she needs to make a full recovery. Now before you say that the network has to make money and blah 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 blah, let me tell you that the ratings for the Wendy Williams show have been pretty good since the premiere in October. Yes, people were expecting that the ratings would drop badly since Wendy wasn't around, but actually it's been the complete opposite and things are looking good. Guest hosts have been doing an amazing job at hosting so the network for sure isn't losing any money. Okay, so let's now get into the details. On November 10, 2021, the U.S. Sun made an exclusive post that the network behind the Wendy Williams show was making plans to replace it with Nick Cannon's new talk show, which was titled, well, Nick Cannon. Currently, Nick Cannon airs right after the Wendy Williams show, but according to The Sun, this is going to change soon if Wendy doesn't make a return. Apart from the unfairness of it all, there's also the fact that replacing Wendy's show with Nick Cannon makes no logical sense. Nick Cannon had its debut on the 27th of September 2021 and only managed to bring in 400,000 viewers. On the other hand, reruns and old episodes of the Wendy Williams show were bringing in more than half a million viewers, so it's definitely a no-brainer that Nick Cannon isn't as profitable as the Wendy Williams show. Fans on Twitter are undecided as to whether or not Nick's show is any good. This fan wondering why Nick even has a show tweeted, I'm late, but who thought it would be a good idea to give Nick Cannon a talk show? This other fan obviously thought it was good and said, I'm late? 
but the Nick Cannon TV show is kind of good. So even among fans, the reviews aren't all that stable. Some fans on Twitter have suggested that rather than cancel the show entirely, Wendy Williams as a host may be replaced permanently by someone else. This person tweeted, I think Kiki Palmer should replace Wendy Williams' spot as far as talk shows. And I totally disagree. I mean, we like Kiki, but I mean, how are we going to have a Wendy Williams show without Wendy Williams? She is the show. She made the show, and I don't think anyone could ever replace her in any way. So how you doing? This fan has a suggestion and tweeted, Sherry Shepard, you're amazing, but no one can replace Wendy Williams. We love her and miss her. Sherry Shepard, you would be a good feeling until she returns. When Wendy returns, it would be nice to see you next to her helping make it easier on her. And I totally agree with this, 100%. For those of you who don't know, Sherry Shepard has hosted an episode on that show, and she did a great great job. So I think that rather than replacing Wendy entirely or giving her slot to Nick Cannon, someone else could hold things down until Wendy gets back on her feet. Anyways, how does Wendy feel about all this? Well, she took to Instagram on November 8, 2021 to give an update and I sensed a hidden message in what she said. She wrote, as everyone knows, my health has been a hot topic. I'm making progress, but it's just one of those things that's taking longer than we expected. I know enough to listen to my doctors and I will return to my purple chair as soon as we all agree I'm ready. I want to thank all of my staff and our guest hosts for stepping up and stepping in while I can't be there. I also I also want to thank Debmar Mercury and our stations for being so understanding and supportive while I work my way back. Now this post was two days before the sun broke the story, but I'm pretty sure that Wendy herself would have heard rumors before it got out. She's queen of celeb tea. I think that her post, especially the part where she thanked the network for being understanding and supportive, was being sarcastic. I think that she was low key calling them out for trying to replace her when she's out sick. I mean, it just makes sense if you think about it. Why would she thank them if they're trying to replace her? I know shade when I see it, and this one is definitely some shade. Do I think that the network deserves the shade? Yes, I certainly do. And you guys know how much I love it when celebs throw shade. But I'm still going to hope that the network is smart enough to not replace Wendy's show and that Wendy feels better soon. I'm not saying that Nick's show should get canceled because come on, he has to pay child support for all seven of his kids. <laughs> all I'm saying is that his show is not even close to being a contender for Wendy Williams. And so the network should stop pretending like it is. Honestly, it seems like they're going to lose themselves some money. It seems to me like the network is hoping that Wendy Williams fans are going to stick around and watch Nick's show, but this is going to blow up in the network's face. I mean, do they seriously expect Wendy's fans to be fine with the fact that their fave got replaced by someone who isn't even as deserving? Come on! They're going to make people boycott Nick Cannon's show, and that's not going to end well for them at all. In the meantime, I gotta hear your thoughts on this issue. Do you think that Wendy's show is really going to get replaced? Who do you think is going to make a great temporary host until Wendy gets better? And if you think this drama is messy, then check out this video. So that's all the Wendy Williams drama for today, my baddies. Make sure you leave me a like on this video, subscribe, and turn on the notifications to be a certified baddie. Never miss any celeb drama when you're tuning in with me. See you later, baddies.